Hello, this is a quick demo on the Sabre filter. It's an SEM filter and it's made by Delta Sound Labs. And I've been using this filter for around about a year, or the, the prototype, and uh, it's a fantastic filter. And I use it in basically everything that I do. Um, so what I'll do is I'll just quickly run through uh, the general setup of the filter and uh, I will go through the cutoff cue, the input signal and the control voltage. I'm using an envelope that's uh, synced to the overall pattern and uh, that will be sending in some extra voltages to, to basically move the cutoff. And uh, I'll be going through the low band and high pass outputs that's on the filter. They can all be used together if you want to do or use one or two. Um, but yeah, so I'll go through the patch first of all without any effects and then I'll start bringing in effects and uh, you, you can kind of hear the difference between both of those things. And uh, I'll take my time through the cutoff as well so you can hear exactly what's happening. I'm using three different oscillators. I'm using a, uh, let's see, I'm using three square waves. Uh, one has a little bit of pulse width modulation and I'm also using the saw wave as well. So that's what you're hearing coming through the filter and that's what I'll be filtering uh, in and out. So without further ado, I'll get uh, I get playing with this so you can hear it and uh, I hope you enjoy. So that's with some effects. I basically have a delay, feedback, and some reverb. So let's take all of those things out. Okay, so we're now here in the dry signal, and the output is a low pass filter. So this is the cutoff. There is also a control voltage going in and increasing the cutoff as well. Um, so let's take that out. So this is solely the cutoff now. And the cue is on the top right. I'll increase the cue. And I'll bring in additional control voltage. So this is essentially an envelope that's um, synced to the global tempo. Add some reverb from clouds. This is such a beautiful song. And this is me using it in its most basic form as well. There's so much more that you can do. But even this alone is, is absolutely beautiful. So this is the control voltage coming in. So I've taken the uh, cutoff right down. I'm going to start increasing that. I'm going to add some reverb, some feedback, and 
So I'll move on now from the low pass to the band pass output. Check the control voltage down again. Off so you can hear with them without. the gain, bring up the control voltage again, add some effects, this is the Bifaco Crush Delay, and a Space Echo, next up Clouds. And lastly, we will check out the high pass. Take out the effects again. Take out the control voltage. So this is now just the cutoff and the Q, which we'll take down a wee bit as well. up a little. Add some effects. We'll start off with clouds this time. The control voltage modulation source that I'm using as well is quite simple. Um, you could make this even more interesting with adding something that's maybe going at twice the speed or something in triplet mode or something like that that would give you really, really nice uh, control voltages coming through and changing um, the cutoff quite nicely. But um, you know, this will give you a good, a good idea as to how it sounds. So I'm gonna put up the EQ and control voltage quite high and move the cut off. Crank the volume. Getting some really nice artifacts there now as well. I'm just gonna take that down again. So there you have it, that's a quick demo of the Delta Sound Labs Sabre SEM filter and um, yeah, check it out, it's a fantastic filter, as I say I've been using it for around about a year and uh, I would highly recommend it. Thanks for watching.